Hi guys, this is Ian, and in today's uh, tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to play the song um, uh, Hallelujah by, originally sung by Leonard Cohen, but I'm going to be teaching you uh, Jeff Buckley's version. Um, this song is a, it's a really nice song, and it's, it's, it has very s simple parts. You basically have the verse and uh, the chorus, which is Hallelujah, Hallelujah. And uh, so, and this uh, this song uses uh, only uh, five chords, if I'm not mistaken. So the five chords are C major, G major, A minor, E minor, and F major. All right. So and the string pattern which you use for this song is uh, just down, down. If you want to like mix it up a little bit, or you want to uh, something a bit more advanced, you can add an uh, a down up stroke instead of just a down stroke. So it's like down 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 up down 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 instead of just down 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 down. And for this song, the strumming pattern is played really really slowly. So it's just going. I heard that there was a secret chord. David played, please the Lord. So it's play, just played really slowly, just play with that nice slow rhythm which, which I'll show you later during the song. <clears throat> so uh, yeah, and also um, I'm just letting you know that some parts of the song where it's kind of high and I'll try and I'll try and hit those notes just to sing it through. But if I don't manage to, I, you know, it's usual, I do apologize. And uh, I will try my best to step through the song as much as possible, however, because um, a lot of the verse, because the verses are all very consistent with each other, what I might do is I will show you, I will step through um, the first verse to show you how and where the chords are pressed specifically and from then on I will just basically play through the verses slowly but just keep an eye on where the chords are pressing, alright? So every verse uses the same chord progression all right so once you know the first one you'll be able to play the rest as well okay but i will show you where the chord changes happened and how the strumming happens uh by singing it through for you okay so <clears throat> the song basically can be broken up into um uh a few sections so you have your intro you have your verse and you have your chorus so it's just three main parts and um uh for the intro the the chord progression that you're using is basically c a minor. So it's C A minor. And in the verse, the first line is C A minor, then C A minor. Alright, so it's I heard C, I heard there was A minor. A secret chord, and then C that David played, and it A minor, please the Lord. But it's F major, you don't really G care for music, C, do you? And then G, well, it C goes like this the F, fourth, the fifth. So this change happens quite quick. The fourth, the fifth, fourth, the fifth, and then A minor, the minor fall, and the F major, major lift, and then G, the baffled king, then E minor, composing heaven, A minor, hallelujah. Okay, so just again, uh, from the the first two lines in the verse are C, A minor, C, A minor. So it's, I heard there was a single chord that David played to please the Lord. Then after that, it's F, G, C, G, C, F, G. Okay, so uh, F, but you don't really G care for music C, do you? G. And then, well, it's C. Goes like this the F fourth the G fifth then A minor 
the minor fall and the F major lift and then G the baffled king the E minor composing and then A minor hallelujah alright and so all the verses follow that sequence so just write it down if you can just remember it and sing you play those chords while you're playing while you're singing through the other verses uh, and so the chorus goes um, it starts with F Hallelujah then A minor Hallelujah then F Hallelujah C G C So again it's F Hallelujah A minor Hallelujah F Hallelujah then C Hallelujah. Okay, and that's how you would play through the entire song. You would just play using those chords. And um, just as a quick tip right now, quickly, um, for those of you who are not comfortable with playing F major like that, what you can do is you can play F7, as I've mentioned in previous tutorials. Uh, which is it's F major but without pressing this last string so instead of pressing 2 you're just pressing 1 so you would sound like this F7 okay instead of F major so what I'll do is I'll run through the entire song and I'll use F7 instead of F major so you can hear that it sounds okay and um, uh, yeah so I'll try and go through it slowly so just watch how the chord changes and the strumming happen as I go through the song okay so I'll just start from the intro all the way to I guess the end of the song okay so from here it's pretty much just just watch and try and follow along with the chord changes okay so the intro is C A minor C A minor and just play a loop one loop two loops of that and then just start with the verse through the chorus and then repeat okay so C A minor, uh, just like the intro, uh, and before you go into the next verse, okay? So from there, A minor, C, A minor, the next verse. Oh, your faith was strong, but you needed proof. You saw her bathing on the roof. The beauty. To her kitchen chair and broke your throne as she cut your head from your lips. She drew the hands of Hallelujah! 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 Hallelujah!
a time when you let me know It's really going on below But now you never show that to me, do you? The song um, uses five main chords, which are C, G, A minor, E minor, and F major. And for those of you who aren't comfortable with playing um, the F major chord, play F7, which is pretty much the same as F major, except you're not playing the last string. And also, um, the original song is played in the key of C sharp. So if you have a capo, what you can do is clip it onto the first fret of your guitar and use the chords which I just showed you in the in the tutorial so uh, uh, Jeff Buckley sings it in the key of C sharp anyway uh, I'm not quite sure which key Lynn Cohen sings it in, it could be C but e either way, if you want to play it in the same way that Jeff Buckley sings it, clip it to the first fret of the guitar Oops. and um, uh, let's see what else um, yeah, uh, for those of you who still have problems with strumming and with pressing chords and changing chords, uh, I do recommend that you visit the site at learnguitarfasttips.com. And what you can and on that site, basically, I have a free guitar course which is designed specifically for absolute beginners to help you um, pick up the skills necessary so that you can go through the song tutorials which I make. And also, I have a list of all the song tutorials uh, which I have created, so you can go there for a quick, easy reference. And if you have trouble pressing the chords, or there are some chords which I mentioned that you're not clear about, go to the site, and if you look on the right side of the sidebar, you know, this may change in future, but for now it's on the right side of the website, it's just a list of all the chords which I use in the tutorials. So just click on the chord you're not sure about, and it will show you a video showing how to place your fingers and press the chord, and that should help you along. All right. So just remember, if you need anything, visit the site at learnguitarfasttips.com, and also, um, uh, if you have any questions or feedback, or if there's something that wasn't clear in the tutorial, or if you just want to say hi or something, feel free to leave a comment in the video or on the site, or to send me a message through the contact form uh, on the site. All right. So with that, um, thanks for watching. Uh, I really appreciate those of you who um, give me feedback for for the tutorials, and I really hope that um, I'll stay motivated to keep making these. Alright, so thanks again for watching and wish you all the best with your practice. So good luck and keep playing.